action. Hi, I'm Tomas, and I'm from Alderman Farms, and today we'll be making spaghetti from the Alderman Farms Instant Pot Cookbook. We have already ground, we have already browned one pound of ground meat. There's like nothing in here. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to add one chopped onion and garlic. Don't put it in. Mm -hmm. And saute it. Saute it. That sounds weird, but... Now we're gonna add one can or jar of stewed tomato. Next? Next we're gonna add one paste tomato. <laughs> one can of tomato paste, that's close. One can of tomato paste, which looks like ice cream it ate looks like, icing. Looks like you wanna taste it, see if it's nope. icing? And you're going to stir that around really good after you have uh, get your tomatoes in there. And that'll help uh, before you get your sauce in there. Next, we're going to add, can you read what that says? Organic tomato sauce. Yes, one can of organic tomato sauce. If you have a small can, you can use the small can. I just if have you want less spaghetti. Yes, that's right, if you, do, if you want less spaghetti, yeah. So we're going to go ahead and add that. We're going to stir that around real good. Yeah, they almost knocked off the camera. After you stir it up good, you put the lid on the Instant Pot and close the valve. And I'm scared. Which way do I turn it? That way. And then we're going to cook it on high pressure. So I, do I turn this thing more? Yeah, that's good. Just like that. It's real simple. Mm -hmm. Then you're going to cook it on high pressure. Do you remember how to do that? Push that. Now you push the manual. It's manual. Okay, can I press it? Mm-hmm. And you got, and it's already on high pressure, but we want to cook it for 12 minutes. So how would you get that to 12? You got to hit the plus to go to 12. Now it's going higher. So what do you think you need to do? No. Now press. Nope. That's it. That's all you have to do. Okay, we're gonna actually do the quick release on here. So that just means let the steam out manually. And once the little stop goes down, then it is safe to open your pot. And so we have spaghetti that tastes like it has been cooked for a long time. That's what why I love doing it in my Instant Pot is because by doing the high pressure it's like it tastes like it's been cooked all day long and it is delicious well here is the final product and so how is it Tomas is it good mm -hmm. what you smell it's one of Tomas's favorite meals that's why I made it that was my favorite first <laughs> sure about that Crying says it was her favorite first. Oh, it was my favorite before you were born.